The world doesn't need an antidote against evil, Connors. It needs a weapon. This nanobot serum is my greatest breakthrough. A new era of nanotechnology begins today. It will change everything. My legacy will be eternal. And I want you, Connors, to see it all unfold. The serum did more than take your legs. You've lost your mind, Smythe! Don't apologize. My mind has never been clearer. I have a responsibility. Why did you want to use a poison on innocent people? If you just let- Don't speak to me like I'm an idiot, Connors. I know your plan. By presenting a solution to the problem you created, you're welcome back to Oscorp like the prodigal son. No. My work will shape the future, not yours. I will save the city. Alistair, I have no doubt that your work is important. That one day it will revolutionize the world. But not this way! I am destroying monsters that threaten to annihilate the city. What is more pure than good against evil? Think of Einstein. Think of Oppenheimer. They unlocked the secrets of the atom to save the world, not destroy it. Their work was corrupted by others, but you, you have a choice. And you had a choice as well. You chose evil. You are either with us or against us, Doctor. Don't make the mistake I made. You have to know there's only one way this will end. Alistair, the serum you injected yourself with wasn't ready. You still have the cross-species virus inside of you. I can help you. And who will help you? Do you think Spider-Man will come to your rescue? I hope he does. It's too bad he isn't here to share this moment with us. This moment? Our trial run. It was your failure to test your sample that led to such unfortunate events. I will not make the same mistake. Funny. I feel them sometimes. As if they still were. But they don't. You've lost it. You belong in a nut house, Alastair! I'm sure you can recommend a few. Cool off a bit as I prepare the nanobot serum. Think about what you've done. <laughs> Seems like I'm always breaking you out of places. Peter? You shouldn't have come. Sorry I'm late. Robots, rush hour traffic, you know. I can't leave you behind! Smite is doing this because of me! So, here we all are. What a meeting of the minds. Cross species detected. Go! Get to your old lab! Bad memories or not, you have to go! You mind if I borrow these, Spider-Man? Connors is right. You shouldn't have come. But I knew you couldn't resist. What would people say if Spider-Man couldn't save his friends? Well, we'll find out soon enough. I'll give you one last chance, Smythe. Stop all this, or... Or what? Connors did his part. And now, you will do yours. And in time, this will all come to an end. What are you talking about? I had no real interest in Connors. I wanted the bigger fish. But let's not spoil the surprise. Soon Oscorp will regret turning their back on me. <laughs> It's gonna be hard getting your job back, unless Oscorp has a work from prison program. <laughs> well, once I save the world from the threat of the cross species, it won't matter what people think of me. My nanobots are the future. <laughs> You're still infected, Smythe. And I don't have much time, do I? And now, my guinea pig, just relax. I won't unleash this on the world without testing it first. I'm not crazy. <laughs> Shh. So, how would you like your tombstone to read? Spider-Man or Peter Parker? 
Wakey, wakey, Spider-Man. What's the matter? Can't handle a few million poisonous nanobots in your bloodstream? I'm... I'm still alive. Give it time. The fun's just starting. You took my legs, but you will never take my genius. My genius created this, and this will pound you into oblivion. Hey, a little warning next time, huh? I'll find the door. My web shooters. Can't leave without those. And my phone, too. I'm too weak to swing on a web. But I can still shoot a few.